I was gonna make one of the best videos of all time, and then I was informed Beyonce already did that, so I'm chief and this is Spreadshot Games. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back. Today I'm going to talk about, I've picked up some, some more consoles and I really, I don't know a lot about them in the fact that I never had them as when I was a kid and I don't own a lot of games for them now and one of them I bought I don't own any games for. So this is almost kind of a help me video for you guys to give me some feedback on you know what games I should pick out for these two systems I picked up. One I do have a game for, but it's only one game. Uh, so a preview. I found this at a, a little bitty resale shop down the road from my house. Uh, is a guy who did like oh what are those storage unit stuff. So it was just cluttered full of furniture stuff, and I found actually a lot of video games there. A lot of consoles there, um, but man, a lot of them are in rough shape. I found a Super Nintendo and a Sega Genesis uh, Generation 1 model there, and when I picked them up, it sounded like they were full of rocks. So, if you can't tell, this is Mortal Kombat 2 for the Sega Genesis. Picked it up for 8, or not Sega, I fucked it up already. Uh, Sega Saturn. So, this is the only Saturn game I have. Uh, pretty sweet condition. Comes with the box. Uh, the box is in good condition. There's no cracks or anything. I really like uh, Mortal Kombat 2. It's probably one of the better ones, I think. I always liked Mortal Kombat when I was a kid, even though I was never good at them, and I'm still not that good at them now. But that's the only Saturn game I have. And just the other day... I picked up a Saturn from a local game store. Um, I got a, a semi good deal on it. He cut me a cut me a break because I'm in there often. But it came with two controllers, all the necessary hookups. So I got a Saturn for around what I figured I would pay for it. Uh, but yeah, so my big thing is with the Saturn, um, what games do you guys suggest watching this? Um, like I said, this is going to be a, a help video for me. What would you suggest are some good Saturn uh, games, games that are good on Saturn, maybe some good exclusive games on Sega Saturn? I know, I think it's Saturn that had all the Panzer Dragoon games on it. I think those were on Dreamcast too, but... Like I, I said before, you know, I was a, I was a PlayStation kid growing up. My neighbor had a Genesis, and then he started upgrading to more uh, Nintendo stuff. So I wasn't very familiar with Sega crap growing up. Um, so you know, make some recommendations on you know what I should what I should get if I if I should start collecting. I really I really don't want to collect a lot of Saturn stuff. But um, give me some good essentials. So if I'm out in the wild, if I find something and it's just like, yeah, man, pick that up. Saturn games are me to me are so rare. Every time I see them, anyway, I want to pick them up. He had Mortal Kombat 2 and Sega Rally. Sega Rally was in a busted up case, and he wanted eight dollars for that too. Coming back and checking prices, I found out this was a deal, and Rally wouldn't have been. So. I'm glad, I'm glad I didn't pick up Rally because the box would look like ass. It's not worth that much. And this game I found is going for 20 complete in box on eBay. So the next one I got, I bought off a guy on Nintendo Age. And it is a TurboGrafx-16. Uh, this system... I know I know nothing about looking looking up online. I got a pretty good deal on that. Uh, I've been told it works and stuff. The guy had excellent feedback. He's uh, on Nintendo Age forums, so I wasn't too worried about him not being truthful. But I know nothing about Turbo Graphics at all. Splat. 
Splatter House looks like a cool game. Um, and that, that's about it. So that's what this video is pretty much about. I got two new systems. Let me know some games that I should pick up if I can find them. If you have any, uh, give me a shout. Maybe I'll pick them up. I'm trying with the holidays and stuff like that. I got a lot of stuff to do. My buying and searching has pretty much come down to just cheap, cheap deals at the moment. So I've quit shelling out, you know, cash or even stuff I want pretty much, which I'm a big um, Super Nintendo and kind of a Nintendo guy. I'll collect pretty much anything, but it's pretty much uh, Super Nintendo. And I'm looking at starting a lot of GameCube stuff, too. I know a lot of people aren't really into doing that that much, but I do like, uh, I do like GameCube a lot. So that, that's my specialty. This is just kind of an outreach video. Um, maybe if you're starting a you know, Saturn collection or wanting to get into Sega stuff, hopefully this video will help you out and like comments or any advice I get and stuff like that. So anyway, yeah, hit me with what you got. Catch you on the flip side. See ya!